Here's how to clean the visor on your motorbike's helmet. I like to use this visor cleaning kit that I got from Muckoff, but you can also just use warm, mild soapy water and a microfiber cloth. The cleaning kit does come with a cloth, so I find that quite handy. I don't know how well you can see this, but especially in the summer, I find that my visor gets really dirty from dead bugs and watermarks and fingerprints and all that kind of thing, so I end up cleaning it quite often. The first thing to do is to remove your visor from the helmet. You don't have to do this, you can do it while the visor's on, but I find this a lot easier. On my HJC C70, you lift the visor all the way up and then it has these sort of quick release clips that you just push and the visor pops out just like that. You can Google how you get the visor off of your helmet. Once that's done, just put it to one side and put the helmet away. So what you want to do here is you want to take the visor and your clean spray or clean solution and just spray a couple of sprays on. It does go a long way, especially once you've wiped it with the cloth, so you don't have to use too much. If your visor is really dirty, like if you've got loads of bugs stuck to it or something, you might want to let that sit for 5-10 to 10 minutes or so, just so it can loosen up all the dirt. As it happens, my visor is not too dirty, so I'm just going to go ahead and wipe the excess solution off. Make sure you're using some kind of soft microfiber cloth, or in this case I'm using the cloth that came with the cleaning kit. You don't want to use something really abrasive like a sponge that's going to scratch your visor. So again, it might be kind of hard to see on the camera, but that's got all the watermarks, all the bug spray and all the fingerprints off as well. So it's looking crystal clear now. I also like to clean the inside of the visor just to get any other fingerprints and dirt off. I don't spray the inside of the visor, I just use the cloth that's already got clean solution on it. If you notice any pieces of dirt that are really stuck on, like here, just give that some extra attention. You might need to spray again, or just give it an extra wipe with the cloth that's already kind of wet from earlier. After that, it's just a case of fitting the visor back onto the helmet. For my helmet, this is a little bit fiddly, but you pretty much have to refit it in the open position like this. And there's two holes in the side that you basically just kind of force it in. I struggled a little bit with mine. It wasn't going in properly. It wasn't clicking in. And then I realized that those two levers that I used to take the visor off, that actually closed again. So I just needed to push them open again um, for the hole to open and let the visor click in. Once that's all done, just open and close the visor a few times and make sure it still locks and everything. And now you should have a nice clean visor and be able to see clearly out of it. Let me know if that was helpful. Safe riding and I'll see you guys in the next one.